on the 21st of July, 2022, during a midweek service at Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries, the Servant of God, Dr. Ian Lovo, gave a prophetic parable about the next leader of the United Kingdom. The following are his words. You know, I saw a series of visions about the Queen of the UK. In the first vision that I saw, it was as if she's watching a soccer match. You know, I don't know whether she watches soccer matches, but she was seated at the VIP section of a stadium. And it was as if she has got her own team that she's what? Supporting the Queen of the UK. And from time to time she would stand up like what people in a soccer match do. That they stand up and they begin to shake and make a lot of noise and then she would stand, sit down. And then in another vision, I saw her, now she was in the soccer field. And she looked as if she was around 19 years old. She's very old now. <laughs> she was no longer the old Coco that we see on TV. She was now a young lady. And the odd thing now is that she was the only woman in, the, in her soccer team. The other soccer team, it was just men. She was the only one woman. I watched the queen of the United Kingdom. She's dribbling. I say, ah, this is a very interesting vision. She's dribbling. She's playing like, you know, an, an experienced soccer player. <laughs> the things that you see in the spirit, she's dribbling. You know, and she's setting up goals and scoring. Again, on the 24th of July, 2022, the servant of God, Dr. Ian Lovu, further explained the meaning of the prophetic parable about a person who was like the queen in a certain way. Watch the following clip for more details. I spoke a message pertaining to the queen in parables. And most people, they were trying to analyze the message. Things of the spirit, you need a revelation to understand them. I tried to say something about the future of that country. By first of all speaking into the life of the queen and also using her as a figure of speech. Using her as a figure of what? Speech. When we were talking about her in a football match and speaking a lot of things about her, it's because something is just about to happen in that country. And whoever will take over that country, who is like the queen in a certain way, we must pray for her to be strong and to be up to the task. I've ended my message. On the 4th of September, 2022, the servant of God, Dr. Ian Glovo, clearly stated in a prophetic message that there was a woman who had risen in the United Kingdom. Watch the following clip for more details. Yes, so last time when, when I was talking about the United Kingdom, I said to this woman who would face a lot of pressures, this woman will face a lot of challenges. So we need to pray for this woman. In the UK, the, <coughs> yes. So we need to pray for this woman because of the challenges that she will face. Hallelujah. The service is just about to come to an end. There is a woman who is just about to rise in the United Kingdom. I won't tell you her name. She's just about to rise. I've spoken about her in the past. So, to people who are spiritual, she's, she has already risen. 
but she will face a lot of challenges. Yes, so we must pray for her. Look at her neighbor and say, we must pray for this woman. Rishi Sunak, 60,399. Liz Truss, 81,326. Therefore, I give notice that Liz Truss is elected as the leader of the Conservative and Unionist Party. We'll come up on Featherfield, Britain has a new Conservative Party leader. That's our developing story this afternoon. We brought you that announcement live in the last hour or so here on ENCA. Now, Liz Truss is taking over from Boris Johnson. She'll be the new Prime Minister of the United Kingdom from tomorrow. Note that from the prophetic message given that the person who is to take over the reins in the United Kingdom is like the Queen in a certain way. This refers to the name of the Prime Minister, Elizabeth Truss, who has the same name as Queen Elizabeth II. The Servant of God, Dr. Ian Lovo, would like to congratulate the Right Honourable Elizabeth Truss for being elected the Prime Minister of the United Kingdom.